Now occasionally uh, we come across units where we pretty well know what the problem is before we even get started because it's something we've seen before. In this case it's an Onkyo TX SR502 receiver, it's several years old now, and it has no sound. Uh, um, this is typically because of a missing 3.3 volt line uh, to the DSP. Check that probe. That thing is so sharp. Diagnosis confirmed. There's an open coil on the uh, uh, preamplifier slash DSP board. Okay, and here's the coil in question, L7002, highlighted right here. That's the on the input side of this uh, voltage regulator. Okay, and here's the replacement part, right there. As I say, I I had them in stock and so I'll be uh, installing that. I'm not sure how the video of that's going to go, but we'll see what happens. It's right in there under that flexible connector. I've pulled out that connector and the little coil in question is right here. Now those are available from Onkyo, of course, and they're, they're very cheap, but uh, I would be comfortable just jumpering that with a small wire. Uh, thankfully, uh, I have that coil in stock, and so I'll be replacing that here uh, as soon as I get the estimate approved. Okay. I will give this a try. It looks like it's going to be pretty shiny in this area. <laughs> Okay, and now we're going to try it again with the coil replaced. Okay, and on the input side, uh, 5 volts. And on the output side, a little less, uh, less voltage drop, 4.6 volts. And so the receiver uh, at this point is fixed.